Well, everybody, uh, Kristen Cavallari is in the news. She's from the Hills, Laguna Beach era. <laughs> She's opening up why she broke up with her TikToker boyfriend, Mark Estes, even though he is, quote, the best boyfriend she's ever had. So Kristen was saying on the Let's Be Honest podcast, well, it's kind of that she thinks he needs life experience. He's only 24 years old. Um, she is 37 with children. <laughs> Divorced, you see? And all the story gets more interesting. So do you think that this was a good reason for her to call it quits, Tom? Yeah, I'll be honest, I like that. Well, I mean, I, 24 to 31 is like a regular gay relationship age gap. Um, <laughs> so like, I don't really get it, but uh, I do think, She's like protesting a little bit too much. I think there's something else going on here. There has to be something a little bit more deep because she clearly thought the relationship was going somewhere at some point because she did introduce him to her kids. Yes. You know what I mean? So right. I know from reading the article that he was looking for something a little bit more serious. He wanted kids and maybe she, she's done. Right. And you know what? That's totally mm, fine. That's and I, I kind of wish that that would have been the, the sentiment that she kind of put forward instead of this like, you're gonna appreciate this in 10 oh. years. I'm like, he doesn't need a mother and you don't want another kid, you know? Right. Like, oh, good point. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. She gave us a gift. Uh, what, what do I think? I think this is the best excuse to end an unfulfilling relationship I've ever had. <laughs> <heard. laughs> myself and I've been and had been using it for 50 years. I mean this is what would you rather hear to end a relationship? We need more space. Mm. It's, it's, it's not you, me, it's, it's you. Me. Yeah, yeah, it's like, or I love you so much, I think you need to have more sex with other people. Yeah. <laughs> That's true, yeah. Do you think she's totally lying? That, uh, okay, so the other theories could be, right? I think they're, you're on to something about the child. But what if it's just that she realized at a certain point, like, I got together with you because of the way you looked and this was good sex for a while, <laughs> but you're actually kind of a dummy McDummerson. <laughs> Right. This, you can't say that. You're, yeah. you, you can't you say can't. that. You can't. Right? So she found the best excuse. She's, yeah, the best. I guess. She's pumped herself up. Look how amazing. Right. Like, I am You're willing so to let you yeah. go instead of falling asleep every time you open your mouth. That's yeah. right. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it could be, too, that she's trying to say, like, you know this thing that you hear sometimes, that someone needs to go off and sow their wild oats mm -hmm. before they settle down? Do, I don't know, though, that, that we... That is like, exactly is what that... must happen for some people. For sure. Some people. Let me explain this to That me. was my story. Her, I felt like she was talking to me. So mm. when I met my now husband, Ryan, he was 24 and I was 29. And it doesn't seem like a big spread. There's a lot that can happen But that's a there, big yeah. spread. Yeah. And Ryan, I mean, he's very handsome, but especially at 24... Oh, yeah. So I was wise enough and nice enough at 29 to know my next relationship, I want it to be the relationship. Right. Mm. And at 24, looking like that, you need to go out and share yourself with the world. And so I, I will say quickly, 24, 29, we were dating for not even two weeks. And he had said, you know, listen, I'm having such a great time with you, but I've got a boy's trip to Las Vegas. I said, wonderful, go. And I literally was trying to like, shove him out the door. Try, try, try. And I made the point of saying, we are not in a relationship. I'm not your boyfriend, girlfriend. This is not what right. this is. Mm. Please go and have fun. Yeah. yeah. You know what he did? You know what that boy did? He said, after a couple of days of the trip, I miss you and I'm Aww. leaving here early. Aww. No, it's off? No, I was like, please don't do that. <laughs> I'll tell you why. I didn't want to be the reason that you would resent me down the ro road to be like, I came back for you and this turned out to be nothing. Having yeah. said that, oh. we just celebrated 16 years married last week. So it all worked out. See, I, I, think... his, I mean, I'll just ask the obvious question, where are his wild oats now? <laughs> I was clearly enough. Yeah. Hey you, come a bit closer. We've got so many more must-see interviews, spicy debates, lifestyle tips, and pop culture moments. So subscribe to our channel by tapping the logo below and don't miss out.